Hello everyone, hope you are doing very well. In this video, I will demonstrate how we can use the copilot, any copilot in Microsoft Teams. So the use case is assume you have created a copilot, a custom copilot, suppose uh, finance and operation, 365 finance and operation copilot, which is the sidecar, right? In this in my previous video, I have explained how to customize this and how to customize and how to talk to your D65 financial, financial operation data or a business strategical data, which is purely specific to this organization. How we can ask the questions related to that, like budget, expense strategy and all. Today, we will demonstrate how we can use this co-pilot in Microsoft Teams. So, similar thing whatever you ask here we can also ask in microsoft teams copilot so uh, say here in the copilot studio so to do that you need to do this from the copilot studio so in my previous video i have explained how to connect the copilot studio with the microsoft dynamics utility of finance and operation app in this video you will see how to use it in microsoft teams so assume these are the custom copilot which you have created and this one is for Copilot for Finance and Operation app, which is this Copilot sidecar. We will, so previously we have added knowledge here based on the, you know, custom process navigation, organization strategy. We have also linked a website with this Copilot, which we are asking in, in the sidecar, right? Like, uh, what is the, sales target for Delhi, right? Let's wait. So this one, the sales target for Delhi is 2000 crore and the target achieved to date is 30%. <clears throat> Same thing, we will do this in Microsoft Teams. So when we publish, when you create a co-pilot and we need to publish, right? So here we just click on publish and it gets published and then we can start using it. But there is another way where we can publish not only in Microsoft Dynamics Editor Finance and Operation or any other application, we can also publish in, in custom connector like SharePoint, Microsoft Teams, Dataverse, all those connectors. How we can do that? I will maybe close it. So we will go to Copilot <clears throat> and we will select this Copilot Finance and Operation app and if you see your copilot is ready here's the where's what's next so here from here publish your copilot so if you click on this publish your copilot you will see all these web all these connectors like telephony uh, microsoft teams demo website custom website skype you know facebook mobile app telegram duilo line group me email direct line speech <clears throat> and these are the uh, enterprise application customer engagement right so these are the connectors where we can utilize this copilot so for today we will use microsoft teams so you need to collect you need to, you need to connect to the microsoft teams and need to make sure that you have access to microsoft teams using this id and whoever is going to ask in microsoft teams related to microsoft dynamics data finance and operation data they must have the license or user id created in microsoft dynamics data finance and operation app so in short the people who needs to ask or need to use the copilot in teams they need to have user id in dynamics data finance and operation also in the teams as well so now uh, uh, we just need to copy it or maybe we can go come back and this is the copilot for finance and operation app copilot preview <clears throat> right you can click on edit details if you want or you can directly click on open copilot so it will take you to the microsoft teams so now I'm going to the Microsoft Teams. Okay, you can just click on add. You can also see the permissions who has. And once it is once this is done, you will be able to see this copilot for finance and operation app in the Teams. So same thing related to Microsoft Dynamics is it your finance and operation data. What we can ask here the same thing i can ask here as well in teams so let's see what is the sales target for delhi 
let's wait same thing whatever you are getting in microsoft dynamics with your financial operation app same thing we will get it maybe uh, for how to create you and here also how to create you so this is the result we are getting in dynamics with your financial operation and here also i am getting the same in the microsoft dynamics with your financial operation right uh, maybe i can ask more here uh, what is the organization strategy maybe and same thing we'll ask here as well so these are all custom pointers uh, which we have added as part of custom corporate in my our previous video now we are asking here right this is the custom one we have done in normal standard you won't be able to get it here we have added the knowledge in the corporate and this is giving the result here also same thing so that in gist you can create any copilot not only finance and operation receiver finance and operation copilot however if you are creating any copilot in copilot studio you can publish the copilot in microsoft teams and you can chat you can chat and you can ask related question uh, in the uh, in the in the microsoft teams as well so that is the integration that is the ease right so there is no coding involved you just need to publish it and you need to select the connector it's like is it a is it a you know teams or telephone right so here you can just utilize this copilot or finance and operation or copilot custom copilot in microsoft teams and you can start utilizing it so that's what i wanted to you know demonstrate i hope you will be able to utilize this in some of the use case in our organization or implementation and thanks for watching that's it for this video bye for now